So to sort of position me uh, in the spring when I arrived, I had to take a math test and I flunked because I didn't know how to multiply by 11 or 12. So I was forced to repeat fourth grade, which actually was merciful because in the course of all the moves, I was not one but two years ahead of myself and therefore very young in each class. So they did me a favor. Uh, and so I regard that as an initially bad thing that turned out to be a good thing. I, I had some money that I was using, that I was going to buy a car with, but I, but I, for a year later, I did my, I was taking the class and I did my research and I found this learner stores. It was a up and coming branch stores for women's clothing. And it had a great story. So I invested my, I think it was $350, which was real money then. Um, and, uh, in uh, in learner stores, and if, you know, because it had these new young managers, and they were going to do all these great things. Well, anyway, I found out I wasn't the only one that had known that it had these new young managers, and it was already embedded in the price. And so, some months later, when I needed to buy the car, um, let us just say I had to buy a somewhat cheaper car than I intended. <laughs> You may well know the sharp ratio isn't really designed for pieces of the portfolio because the risk it uses is the risk of that piece. And in a portfolio, the risk that matters is the risk that isn't going to be basically diminished and or washed out by diversification across the other 19 members of the of the tribe. So it's it's really not the right application. But I've long given up. You know, I don't argue against that and just as long as they spell my name right, what the hell? <laughs> I am the I am the, the world's most boring buy and hold investor. I kind of favor for the average investor, not for professionals, but for the average investor, that your your default is buy and hold. If you're still taking putting money in or you're at the stage where you're taking money out, then you want to think about where you put it in when you put it in, where you take it out if you take it out. But but try to try to not spend a lot of effort on trading within the portfolio. Um, now, again, the nice thing about that is everybody could do it. Everybody could do nothing. <laughs>